the importance of customer experience. No matter what you do, no matter how quality of a product or service you have, your touch point where the rubber meets the road, right? When people walk in, make a phone call, do an online service, send you an email. If that touch point, if that experience has a lot of friction, you're going to lose customers, period. I've just gone through a process, and if you follow things on Twitter, you would know who I'm talking about, but I'm not gonna mention them in this video, with a cable provider. And it's just been days of calls, dropped calls, things moved to people who I can't understand. And I can say that as an immigrant, this is my second language. Um, but I really cannot understand what they're saying. And not only because of accents, but I can't understand what they're saying because of the quality of the connection, the headpiece that they're wearing. And you can also hear the ambient noise. There is hundred people around them all talking at the same time. So no matter what you try to do through your customer retention program, if that is the experience that I have, I am going to leave or I'm going to downgrade and keep downgrading my services until I find a better option. 2020 is six weeks away. People, especially in the part of the world that we live in, people have options. Treat your customer the right way and start doing everything you can to remove layers of friction, challenges and obstacles. Bouncing people around, having them wait for 20 minutes to then dropping their call, saying, yes, I can make change A, but I can't make change B. I have to transfer you to somebody else. That's the customer service of the 90s, early 2000s. It is not what folks should be dealing with today. So I implore you, if you're in a position of leadership and you have customer service departments, areas, pay attention to them. If that is what your customers experience, that is what they're gonna talk about tonight at home, during dinner, with their spouse, their kids, their parents, their cousins, their neighbors. That's what they're gonna talk about today or tomorrow at work. That is the word of mouth, which still has value and it will always have value. And that is how your brand and your reputation is looked at. So. Customer experience matters. Quality product and services matter as well, but your, your interactions with your customers, current and perspective, matter. Play the long game, not based on your quarterly earnings calls. You have a wonderful day. I wish you all the best. As always, if this is the first video you see, please consider subscribing and sharing it with your friends and colleagues. And most importantly, leave your thoughts and comments below the video on the topic that I've just covered. Have a great day.